At David Lipscomb College, what you learn and what you believe go hand in hand. As you develop a strong foundation of academic knowledge and professional know-how, you'll also develop a deeper connection to your faith, your community, and your world. You bring the commitment and curiosity. We'll prepare you to put them to good use. This video serves as an introduction to your college experience. Whether you begin your exciting college journey knowing exactly what you'd like to do, or still have a little research to do, we're here to help. When you come to David Lipscomb College, be prepared. The moment you step onto campus, you'll feel the energy. That's because being a bison means being busy. Living, playing, worshiping, competing. All the things we do together make us stronger as individuals and as a community. And we're not allergic to having some fun while we're at it. You've just been introduced to your new student orientation team. Their mission is to acquaint you with our community, our campus, and our core values. Call it Southern hospitality or just plain friendliness, but we love welcoming new students at our almost 80-year-old Heart of Nashville campus. Let's begin our college journey by taking a look at the most essential items you'll be bringing to campus. Meet Douglas. He's a new student, just like you. And just like you, he's curious about what he needs to bring to succeed as a member of the bison herd. Let's start with the basics. Backpack. Textbooks. Shower caddy. Umbrella. Pool float. Your middle school basketball trophy. A box of various candles. Alcohol? Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Nice try, Gregory. Surely you're not that foolish. David Livingston College is dedicated to providing a safe campus that alcohol, illegal substance, and tobacco free. Campus isn't the only thing that's always popping. The Green Hills and greater Nashville area have tons of opportunities to have fun, eat well, and get active. What are some restaurants in the Nashville area that I should go to? I hear Martin's has some great barbecue and maybe some hot chicken from Hattie B's. You don't want the hassle of traffic and long wait times, do you? At David Lipscomb Bison Cafe, we serve three above-average meals every weekday. Downstairs, you can find a wide selection of cuisines, such as Papa John's Pizza, offering a multitude of toppings for every hungry student, like cheese, pepperoni. Why not enjoy unlimited soft drinks from our Pepsi Cola fountains while you're at it? What are some cool parks around Nashville I could go to? Why go all the way to a crime-ridden slum like Centennial Park when you can rest your behind on a well-manicured lawn at David Lipscomb's Quad? I heard Nashville has a great music scene. What are some venues I could check out? Why waste all that money on expensive concert tickets when you can attend a free weekly gathering service? Our praise team features local artists such as Girl That Sits Behind You in Freshman Seminar, Guy That Wears the Same Red Jacket Every Day, and girl who doesn't know to shut up about her relationship problems because she just found out Brandon was cheating on her and she wants everyone to think she's moved on to Chad. But Chad isn't really a better guy. I saw him yesterday in the gym flirting with Terry on the ellipticals. You know Terry. She's the one in communication who doesn't understand the concept of assigned seating. I mean, come on. Everyone stays in the same seat they sat in on the first day. I know what you do, Terry. This happens in every class you are in. I've talked to my friends. They notice too. You've become that girl to a lot of people, Terry. How does it make you feel? I bet you really like the attention, don't you? Billy and Janice have been going steady for weeks. And Billy thinks now's the time for the first move. It's the third Tuesday of the month, and judging by the schedule, it's time for open dorm. Whoa there, champ! David Lipscomb's open dorm policy specifically states that all feet must remain in contact with the floor at all times. Janice, you're 30 minutes past your allotted visiting hours. Uh, we could go out. I don't know about that, Billy. David Lipscomb's strict first-year curfew is at 12, so you might want to reschedule. Nothing good happens after midnight anyway. What have you learned today about life at David Lipscomb? Turn to your neighbor and discuss one fun fact that you've learned from the video. Why haven't you turned to your neighbor? Do it! This video has equipped you with all the necessary information you will need to survive your first year at David Lipscomb College. The minute you step onto the David Lipscomb campus, you'll feel it. There's a sense of forward momentum and deep camaraderie in everything we do. 
We are, first and foremost, a community. You'll never be bored, and you'll never be lonely at David Lipscomb College. We welcome you, and we are so glad that you are here.